Hey there! In this video, I want to talk about the differences between software developer in test and software developer. Stay tuned! Hey there! Uh, my name is Eugene. Welcome to my channel. Uh, this is my channel and I talk about software quality and software development, how to make your product better and how to make yourself better. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel and uh, don't forget to click that bell notification button so you get notification every single time I post a new video. So in this video, in today's video, we're going to talk about similar similarities and differences between SDEP and um, uh, software developer. So, uh, software developer in test, uh, let, let me just like give you a little background. So both, I think both uh, ASDA and DEV, like it's a software development, uh, those are software development specialties and uh, ASDA is a software development specialty because they, they both write code, they wrote, they both uh, have to deal with the like pretty complex um, infrastructures and pre pre and pretty complex frameworks. So, but there are like there are pretty significant differences sometimes when it comes to the scope and the specialty itself. So, um, in general, software developer and tests they focusing on implementing automated tests, and software developer they are focusing on implementing new features. It's a it's a short and uh, short and concise answer what is the difference between two specialties but let's dive a little bit deeper into those specialties and see what is the difference and what is the similarities and especially if you as that or if you're thinking about like or if you're a software developer and you're thinking about switching those fields and like do something like differently in your career that video this video may be really helpful for you so let's start with our uh, differences. How different software developer and software developer in test. So let's start with the interview. So when it comes to the interview process there, it's pretty similar. You, as a as that, you will be asked um, coding questions, coding challenges, like things like that. So pretty standard. However, when it comes to the code itself, your challenges are gonna be a little bit more easier so it's a good thing so i'm not saying it's going to be easy for you necessarily but the complexity of the code challenges is a little different it's just a little easier on the other hand uh you will be asked a lot of questions about testing and a lot of questions how you think and how you implement your testing infrastructure what is you why are you focusing when you're testing things so and things like that so this is kind of trade-off with the uh, for like easier coding challenge, but you have to answer a lot of questions about testing. So, um, yeah, before you stop typing and say like, but like, as a software developer in test, my interview was pretty complex and they asked me the whole lot of questions of the whole lot of whiteboarding questions about the code. It was pretty, it was pretty intense. Each and every interview is different. Sometimes for uh, like production developer, sometimes you just a heavy like uh, you, you have a conversation with your uh, hiring managers and they hire you. So it does happen. So, but in in, in general, like the coding challenge is going to be a little bit a little bit simpler, a little bit easier. So, but you're gonna be asked a lot of questions about coding, um, about testing and how you test things. Scope. Uh, scope is really important and I, I think it's the most drastic difference between our specialties as a software developer as a software developer in test your scope is to test the application that is already was written that is already there and and your thing is like to discover those uh, vulnerable places well like edge cases and make sure that your product is not breaking there as a software developer um, you, you have nothing sometimes uh, you have nothing uh, like you have no foundation like to build on like if you're building a new application from scratch or new feature and you have to think about architecture you have to think about logic you have to think about how to implement it so it's a little bit more complex and you have a little bit more responsibility because if you implement a wrong solution so chances are you have to like redo it again so 
as, a, as that you focusing on already a project that is already written for you that is already there and you discover like weak points and vulnerable points in that application as a software developer you're building everything from scratch and you think about bigger picture and how to implement it and how to implement it, implement it with, a, with, a, with a better uh, architecture so the same kind of fo focus uh, kind of goes to the scope because as a software developer you're focusing on building as a as that you're focusing on testing and breaking things so the focus is a little different too so when it comes to testing uh, both software developer and like as that obviously we have tests in our title um, uh, you have to test but as a software developer when it comes to testing you test your product you test your feature if it is working yes but you're also focusing on unit testing and uh, on the lower level testing so as a as that you vote fo your focus uh, you focus in on, on the broader on uh, on the broader picture how like integration testing and end-to-end -end testing so this is your focus and um, this is a little different let's talk about similarities so like both software developer and test and software developer is a software development field you both write code you both have to know a programming language pretty well so by the scope of programming language that you guys are gonna use they're a little it's it's just a little different and because as i said the scope and focus is a little different for both for those disciplines in software development community so uh, the first similarity uh, we, you, we all write code so clean code best practices dry code is very important for like production developer and software developer you both building a product an application as a software developer, you build a new application, a new product. As a software developer test, you build an application that will test another application. So you both building, but your applications do different things. Uh, testing, as I mentioned, like yes, testing is different, but we we both have to test and. For uh, as that, it's a little another difference for as that. Not only we have to test the product, but we also have to test our infrastructure, our test automation framework, if it works and if it actually tests this thing. So we have to do double testing. We have to test your product, and we have to test our uh, our application, uh, our uh, framework, if it is implemented correctly. So these are similarities and differences between software developer and software developer and test so uh and i think skills are pretty transferable um the i'm i'm probably gonna make another video like about like doing production development and uh development about uh focusing on testing but i think those skills are pretty transferable and if you know a programming language if you if you have mindset of problem problem sol solving uh, skills because both like production developer and as that we both try to solve a problem um, just with a different focus so I think skills are pretty transferable but um, and the difference is just with the tools and um, um, and the scope so thank you so much for watching and let me know uh, let me know if you have any questions and let me know if you're a software developer who transition either from as that to software development to production development or vice versa if you are a software developer and you've uh, switched to test automation and as that role let me know let me know your transition let me know what you like better thank you so much for watching and i will see you in the next video bye